we will see consistency and replication of data in parallel and distributed systems. Now for consistency and replication, an important issue in distributed system is the replication of data. Data are generally replicated to enhance the reliability or to improve the performance. That is when we replicate the data, we feel that if we lose a particular data at one instant, at least we have a copy of it. That is one of the major reasons the data is replicated. Now keeping the replicas consistent is something very important. That is if we have one replica at one system and we update it but the replicas at the other places are not updated. So it leads to inconsistency. So the important thing is we have to keep the replicas consistent. Informally this means that when one copy is updated we need to ensure that the other copies are updated as well otherwise replicas will have no longer the same value. The client centric consistency model concentrate on the consistency from the perspective of a single client. The client centric consistency model usually works with the mobile consistency. Here we will see by the end of this video presentation that how the client centric consistency model helps with the mobile consistency which we very frequently use. Now, What are the reasons for replications? Data are replicated to increase the reliability of a system but yes when we replicate the data we lose on the performance of a system but still we do sometimes as we need the data with the fear that if I lose the data now I may have a copy of it for later use. Scaling with respect to size of a geographical area may also require replication. That is if I am at one place today and move on to the other place I will be able to use it. So I keep a multiple copies stored on the cloud or on the web so that I can use it wherever I go. That is the reason we need replications. Now performance and scalability. To keep the replicas consistent we need to ensure that all the conflicting operations are done in the same order everywhere. If we do write read then everywhere the write and read process should be done. It should not be that I read it first and write it later and if there are any changes then it leads to conflict. It is the first thing is read write conflict. A read operation and a write operation act concurrently and a write write conflict that is two concurrent write operations. If I have my copies replicated at two places and I am simultaneously trying to write something, this may lead to my performance getting degradable and it leads to sometimes replicas not being consistent. Now data centric consistency model, a contrast between a data store and process in which the data store specifies precisely what is the result of read and write operations are in the presence of concurrency. A data store is a distributed collection of storage where the data is there. If I have a read and a write operation happening simultaneously then what will be its result that we will see. Now this is a data centric consistency model scenario. I have a local copy over here let's say at three places and then I have a process running simultaneously and this is my distributed store. So when this local copy is you can see it is shared over here and if there is a write write operation happening then it should be updated immediately at both the places otherwise it will lead to inconsistency. Now what is a continuous consistency? Now continuous consistencies happen that replicas may differ in their numerical values as they are not updated properly. Replicas may differ in their relative staleness that is after some time the data gets updated so values which are getting changed may get little older and which are at present not used for the current calculation. There may be difference with respect to number and order of performed update operation that is I may have performed read read write read but while on the replica I have read write read write. So what has happened? Maybe you will feel whether I have done read read write and read and read write read write what difference does it make if I have not done any changes but yes on a longer run it leads to a consistency problem and it is not continuously consistent so everything has to be done parallelly. Consistency unit specifies the data unit over which the consistency is measured. 
Now another one is a sequential consistency. The result of any execution is same if the read and write operation by all processes on the data store were executed in the same sequential order and operations of each individual process appears in this sequence in the order specified by its program. That is, it should happen on both the process, let it be anywhere on the geographical location. The sequential consistency should be maintained. That is, if I am following a particular procedure in my program, then on all the models where I have created the replication should follow the same for the sequential consistency. The casual consistency is writes that are potentially casually related must be seen by all the processes in the same order that is when I'm writing some data so all of them should be seeing it in the same order at the same timestamp concurrent writes may be seen in different order by different processes so it can be seen differently but it should be in the same order but if the processes are concurrent then only now what are the client centric model the client centric consistency model has system model, monotonic read, monotonic writes, read your writes, write follows your reads. Now this is one model. Now this is a client centric consistency model. There is a WAN that is wide area network. We have the data models or data local data at all the places. The clients once I have assumed that the client is here, second time in my geogra geographical location it has moved to this part. And he, the particular he or she should be able to use the data from here. And replicas need to maintain the data centric consistency, that is data everywhere should be same. Now for the client centric consistency model, the best example is a mobile centric consistency. Now for this, what are the monotonic reads? The monotonic reads is when I'm using a mobile centric consistency model then what happens is whatever I read whether I'm in one ge geographical location or any other ge geographical location my data is retrieved in a similar way from the server on my mobile phone. The server I'm connected to gives me a single read that is my read remains the same whether I am in an X part of the world or a Y part of the world. Similarly for the monotonic writes whatever I write gets immediately updated on my server for a client centric consistency model there is no change there is no delay that is when I'm working on my mobile phone the servers are automatically updated so my mobile whatever I write gets immediately updated read your rights now read your rights is whatever you're writing there's one prior intimation that kindly read whatever was previously written so that if there was a delay usually there is not if there is a delay then we can do the corrections in the server and similar thing happens is write follows your reads so when you've read whatever updates you've done previously for the client centric model or for the usage of data that you're using then you write the same thank you